And what's been going on with you? <laughs> well, I feel like I haven't felt in years, and it's amazing. What? You're completely different. What happened? I, I just fixed what was wrong. Don't worry about me anymore. I'm fine. You're saying that you're over whatever was making you want to kill yourself six months ago? <sighs> so far back, I can't even remember. All I know is I want to be here. Zach, at the party before you left, you were trying to tell me something, and I was just ignoring you. I'm sorry, but I want to know now. What was wrong? It doesn't matter anymore. I'm fine. Zach, your dad's here. See? Even that doesn't bother me anymore. So how's he been? Well, I think all that forced counseling did him a lot of good. Well, it better have. I can't watch over him again like I did when he had his breakdown in high school. I wasted all my time on a... Ah! Zach, you made it down. Of course, Father. It's always a pleasure to see you. Well, I wish I could say the same, but I've seen enough of you over the last six months. Now, that place gave me the creeps, all those nurses and screaming people. Well, it worked. You wanna, want me to show you my room? That tiny ass thing. Sure, why not? Oh, Tim, before I forget, uh, your dad's outside on the phone, just like every other time I've seen him? Yeah, same here. I talked to him about this last week. He said he'd take care of it. Hold on, Tim. I've got other divisions run. I don't have time for this. He's going to have to handle it. So these divisions are run by people that aren't complete idiots. Some of them even have brains. Hey, uh, dude, can I help you? I'm, uh, I'm, I'm looking for Erin. Okay, well, she's inside. Uh, if you want, you can wait over by that guy. Hey. Hey. Uh, buddy's over here rooting through the trash, so. Yeah, no, it's, he has some notes from class that we're both in that apparently I needed today. Huh. Did I see your dad over there earlier? Uh, yeah, I swear. My, me and my dad aren't going to be in the same room for over five minutes. Just watch. What the hell are you doing here? You wouldn't answer your phone? Yeah, so come to my boyfriend's house. That makes sense. Well, it's Thanksgiving. Are you not thankful to have me in your life? No! You know what I am thankful for is my boyfriend, Adam. Who I love. Okay, there's nothing going on between you and me. Yes, there is. Stop pulling this crap about your boyfriend. You're bored. You want something new. You know what? You need to leave. I need to make dinner, and there's no room for unwanted guests. Hi. Hello, I'm Blake's mother. Oh, I'm Melanie. Oh, you're uh, Blake's little thing. Oh, what are you, 6'3"? You're, you're gigantic. Blake's in the bathroom. You should wait in the living room. I'm gonna go do something. Hello, you must be Blake's mother. And you are? Oh, I'm Gina, Melanie's sister. Yeah, so what's Blake's problem? You got all day? Oh, <laughs> great, you're here. You know, I've been here an entire minute and you've not offered me a drink yet. What's wrong with that? So many things. You know I don't live here, right? Uh, and that affects your pouring arm how? Um... Don't worry, I'll get it for you. Then we can chat. <laughs> you seem so nice. You know that girl that met me at the door? You could do a lot better than that Amazon queen. January? Yeah, and I'm not moving it. I can't have this case prepared in two months. Well, you're ready enough. I can't be in here much longer. I need to be out there getting back together with Beth. Yeah. You do know the that if I'm not ready for this, you'll be in here a lot longer. It's an open and shut case. I'm innocent. Do they have video of you confronting him, and the file was watched around the estimated time of death of Sarah Thompson. Which clearly implies I I, I, that you... Okay, I don't care what it implies. You are my lawyer, and you do as I say. I don't know if I'll have it ready in two months. I suggest you dump Beth to make more time for this case. Hi, um, do you know how much longer my boyfriend's gonna be back there? We have plans for Thanksgiving. Who's your boyfriend? Uh, Jack Perry. He's a defending attorney. 
Uh, who's his client? I'm not too sure, but it has to be someone important because we rushed over here on Thanksgiving. Uh, it is. Oh, of course. That makes sense. What? He's seeing William Lawrence. He's being charged on two counts of murder. A college kid. Can you believe it? No. Thank you. Chop, 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 cheater, cheater, chop. Shut cheater, the hell up. Cheater. Who are you talking to? Sorry, little bird. Really loud, you know? How are you? Fine. Is dinner almost done? I can't really stay very long. I you know, things are going to be great. Great, great, great. Okay. Just hurry, all right? All this guilt you're feeling it means you really don't want to hurt Adam. You don't understand. Or maybe since you're dead, I don't understand. I don't know. Do tell. You know, all my life, it's been safe, you know? I've been given this great life and I have no reason to complain for anything. And yet, it all seems so fake, you know? I don't have any idea who I am. But... You see, that sounds a lot like an excuse. No! She just used them all the time. It's okay, I think they run on them. Everybody in there has a problem. Why can't I? Because you're better than them. But I shouldn't have to be! Here I am, the nice, perfect little girl cooking the ultimate Thanksgiving dinner. You know, I have flaws too. I, I just can't talk about them, you know? Yeah. Or you're still a cheater. <coughs> Hi, Mr. J. I'm Vanessa. Vanessa? Well, that sounds familiar. Are you the one that Zach had been in love with for the last five years? Uh, the girl that he could never shut up about? What? Uh, yeah, no, he used to talk about you all the time. Uh, used to, past tense. I haven't said a word about you since his accident. I visited him every week in the hospital. Yeah, well, he's probably forgotten about you since the accident. <clears throat> Where's the food? Wow, Dad, you actually were able to get us in your busy schedule and do what you promise. How nice of you. I'm sorry if doing my job takes precedence over your, your little make-believe uh, Thanksgiving feast. The food's not ready. I don't have much time. Let's just serve the badly cooked food already. Hey, my girlfriend worked really hard to make this. And I helped. So that's gonna make it good? God, this is terrible. Zach, how about we go out for a pizza? No, you're not thankful about anything anyway, huh? Food's ready, so everyone sit down, shut up, and we will eat. Nothing like a whole bunch of angry guests to distract you from your guilt. All right, bring it on the awkward. So, Melanie, how's school going? Good. Blake and I are both in Principles of Engineering, too, and um, it's challenging, but we're both doing really well. <coughs> I highly doubt that. Hey, Melanie is smart. She's gotten A's before. She showed me. I believe she was with...